What's up guys, Donity605 here, and today I'm here to introduce to you a new update to the custom firmware uh, uh, developers that actually uh, updated the custom firmware for Homebrew on PlayStation 3. Uh, Sony has, re a week ago, Sony has uh, released a uh, Homebrew, uh, or not Homebrew, uh, official firmware update uh, on their consoles, so... That means if I go to on PS Network System Calls and I try to sign in, it'll ask if a, uh, for a new system uh, software update. What you want to do is you want to make sure that you click no. And then you go make double check, make sure that your USB drive can be read by the system. I'll have the uh, update file in the description for you in this video. I also got a new camera. So what you want to do is you want to go to the link in the description to get the new custom firmware update. It has been released by EvilNat, the official custom firmware developer. If you install the um uh of the official firmware by accident when signing in, or if you ask if you went uh, to uh by uh update via internet by accident, which I have no at longer have access to right now, um you would have to uh follow a different guide for this but this is just for people who haven't updated at all and are waiting for a custom firmware installation update so what you want to do is you want to go to the link in the description i'll have it for you in the description of this video and then make sure that uh automatic updates are off in case you didn't it'd be right here and then you can check to see if that's off by highlighting it with the uh, x, pad, x button and pressing off and then you can go to system update. Then go to, if you're US, using USB, which I like to do. Um, yeah, you put it in the rightmost USB port, and then you want to update via storage media. It'll say 4.91. This is you may think that this is actually the uh, latest update. But no, this is actually the custom firmware exploited version. Now remember, you need a hybrid firmware version and also you need a patched PS3 in order to do this. So hybrid firmware, remember, twice first. Then flash that uh, a me a memory and patch it uh, via the BG tool set in 4.90. Now my tutorial was a little bit scuffed because um, I had like I advice um, give given from like um Blaine Locklear's tutorial so it was a little bit harder to do however I followed it for myself but it, what I'm going to do here is I'm going to update via storage uh, system storage to make sure I don't make any mistakes and as you can see I have a bunch of uh options here from firmware versions in the past I'm going to select 4.91 for the purpose of this uh tutorial because let's be honest <laughs> we like to play online don't we And it's going to restart the system once it hits 100%. And then once that does that, it's going to start up an installation. Just like you would when you were installing the custom firmware. If you get, by the way, if you get to the screen and you don't see any succession and progression, I highly recommend checking out uh, my 4.90 tutorial or actually some other tutorial on how to fix that issue with the official firmware that is actually causing issues. Now remember, the official firmware is not going to work and resetting uh, uh, re re resetting your console is not going to work either. So, bear in mind. Okay. Well, that was finally finished. Now it's gonna reboot, and it should be on Evil Mat. And there we go. Now, as you can see, I can showcase to you what they recently added in this new custom firmware update, which means they actually made it send enabled, which means PlayStation Network enabled. Um, so I can go into Let's see. There's been some new stuff with rebug tools, for example. 
You can patch unused LV1 system calls. When an error has occurred. Okay, so I guess I haven't done anything right for that. LV2 memory protection. Put patch shut down on LV2 modification. And then H tab mapping with write protection. Enable or disable write protect. Okay, disabled. Uh, enable or disable INDI access. Update manager EE prom write access. Dispatch manager access while ENC deck uh, IDCTL uh, command. Um, all right. System manager ability mask to of game OS. Extract all package types. Okay, this one might come in handy later on. Full access to repo nodes and LPAR. I'll create, modify, delete all repository nodes. Okay. LV1, full access to FC, R1, SR1, SPE, register. Allow all uh, bit access to the registry. The register. All right. LV1, access to set data breakpoints. Enable LV1 access to LV1 set date. Or da dab. What? Oh. Hmm. LV1 access to GPU guard memory. Allow LV1 to use 4K beat IO page size. Okay. What does that do? I'm not going to figure out just yet. Uh, storage manager and ENC deck at key access. Allow storage manager to clear ENC deck keys. Skip all ALs, ACL checks. Enable skipping of ACL checks for all storage devices. An initial guest OS loader. Enable guest OS for one for game OS. There it is, folks. Now, of course, what I could see is what is this? The update manager. Huh. Homebrew packages. Oh, I didn't mean to click that. Uh, Alright, so. Cobra tools. So, as you can see, we are on Cobra version 4.91 with the file type Kex Cobra. That's. That's system called and eight enabled. Alright, well, when we disable system calls, that's going to be disabled. Yes. And then I can go on to PSN and sign in. There you go, folks. That's how you get it back online with custom firmware on your PS3. Thanks, guys, for watching this video. Don't forget to subscribe, leave a like, and thanks for supporting my channel. Let me know what you thought in uh, these types of videos, like what what you might have found interesting through these contents. Uh, if you're uh, interested in uh, leaving a like, subscribe. Be sure to uh, uh, leave a like uh, uh, in future videos as well if you're interested for coming back. So I appreciate you guys' support. Thank you guys so much, so much for watching. Don't forget to subscribe. And uh, by call 1-800-CLICK-THAT-FRICKIT-SUBSCRIBE BUTTON. That's 1-800-CLICK-THAT-FRICKIT-SUBSCRIBE BUTTON. All right, I'll see you guys later. Peace and chicken grease. Bye.